turn. Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. So go ahead and do this. She really got that um, feminine walk going for her. Okay, random. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and rhapsodize about pan piano sonatas. Uh, let's no, let's not share the big news with her. You gotta tell your husband first. You can't just randomly tell some person you meet. Tell a joke about Sunset Valley. Heartfelt compliment. Gossip. Uh, who's about new show? Brighten her day. Debate game strategy. Uh, tell her an outrageous story. Okay, so hopefully we can make this girl our friend. Why are you talking about tricking people with hand buzzers? Not really sure. Alright, go ahead and discuss your interests with her. Compliment her outfit. That it's not really that great. Discuss logic puzzles. Uh, get to know her. Tell her a funny story. Discuss world peace. We'll see what she thinks about all that. Oh. Okay, so she's self-assured, which we don't have that trait. Um, ask about her day. Tell her a funny story. Uh, deep conversation. Impersonating a celebrity. Okay. Let's go. Where's this lady going? If you have to pee, go right here. It's a lot closer and you're going the wrong way. She totally didn't... Why is she running so fast? <laughs> she was really running fast, wasn't she? What? No, no, just go here now. M lady, listen to me. <laughs> I'm gonna strangle you in about a minute. Figure it out where you're going. You really gotta pee that bad? Where you couldn't talk... No, you don't even have to pee that bad. What is wrong with her? She just lost a friend. Gosh darn it. Alright, talk with this lady. Give her a funny, funny introduction. Okay, here we go. Now let's talk to her. Erin Boya. All right, let's see. Obatosh, brain juice. Tell her a funny story. Uh, heartfelt compliment. Discuss interests. Brighten her day. Tell a joke about monkeys. I don't know what the joke would be, but okay. Tell her an outrageous story. Knock knock joke. Uh, do this about a new show. An impersonate celebrity. Okay. Why are all these people leaving me? Uh, flash of crazy eyes. Uh, get to know her. Ask about her day. Gossip with her. Go ahead and rhapsodize about pianos. Things. Compliment her outfit. Go ahead and do an impression. Discuss world peace. Gossip. Ask her to hang out. What are they doing? She's just sitting there like, I don't think I want to talk to this girl anymore. 
Where are you doing? Ask her to hang out. She just keeps dropping these. I don't get it. Deep conversation. Uh, discuss logic puzzles. Do an impression. She's also good. So discuss world peace with her. Because she would like that. What happened to the other girl? I don't know. She just got up and walked away. Tell her an engaging story. Uh, brighten her day. Deep conversation. Discuss your interests. Flash your crazy eyes. Knock knock joke. Gossip. Are we friends now? <laughs> We're friends. Okay. Let's find someone else to talk with. She's up to comedy level three. She can now compose and perform several new short routines with computer and microphone, respectively. Okay. We'll talk with this girl next. Oh my goodness, this is that person girl. <laughs> Alright, let's bring Derek here. Uh, bring Derek Millman here. What do you need? Why don't you go to the bathroom? And then we'll get you to eat when you get home. Alright, stop talking. Come over here and let's give her a funny introduction. Um, let's see. We also need to tell Derek about the baby, so. Um, flash your crazy eyes. Go ahead and brighten her day. Uh, discuss logic puzzles. Discuss world peace. She's a goofball. Okay. Uh, get to know her. Discuss your interests. Glaive Narza. Do an impression. I don't really know. Derek, what do you want to do, buddy? You want to make an enemy? Who's this? Shane Engel? You're horrible. Why don't you come eat some of the hot dogs? Oh, the tofu dogs. Grab a serving of those. Kimber Check if you guys are friends. How much time left in the first trimester? Um, seven hours. Tell a joke about politicians. She's a loner. Oh, goodness. Gossip. Compliment her outfit. Discuss logic puzzles. Discuss your interests. Uh, person eat celebrity. Ask about her day. Um, discuss latest games. Alright, speed up. Alright, and we're gonna get you guys to grab a plate together. Grab a serving together. Because you are hungry. Alright, you wanna make an enemy? Wait, you wanna chat with someone, right? Let's let your wife tell you the big news. So, share the big news with him. <laughs> Is he excited? He is excited! Yay! Alright. Go to work feeling confident. You are chatting with someone, aren't you? Alright, tell an engaging story. <laughs> Knock knock joke. Heartfelt compliment. Gossip. Mm, Brighton day. 
Shrozis Abimi? Discuss logic puzzles. Shoot to charisma level three now. She can donate to online charity, practice pickup lines at a mirror, and can flatter other sins. Okay. They've got to be really close to being friends. So let's see. Tell an engaging story. Flatter her. Snibara Watanini. Flazzle Pelka. Ask her move in. I don't think so. Deep conversation. Gossip. Joke about old times. Okay. Oh, I think they're friends. Yep, they are. Good. All right. F those two more, you're going to stop talking. So you can eat that. All right, eat. I said eat. <laughs> she doesn't listen. All right, you don't need to talk with her. Um. Yeah, we've got to find something for him to do. You know what I'm going to do, though? Let's do this. Hi! Let's go ahead and build, like, a small little pool for here, for the park. We'll put, we'll build it over here. There's nothing really over here, so let's build it over here. Let's build a pool. Okay, here. Put this here. It doesn't cost me anything, so... That way we can use a pool if we want to. And then other people can use it as well. So it's nice. Alright, and we'll just put a ladder on it. Doesn't really matter what else it needs. Um, we'll put some lights on it. Okay. So let's let Derek get in the pool. Let's go ahead and swim laps. And when she's done, she can come over. Actually, she needs to go to the bathroom. Oh, you're going to talk with Cassandra. My goodness, Cassandra actually came over to talk to you. I'm surprised. Arnold. <laughs> Alright, so let's finish eating quickly. You done? Alright, go to the bathroom. Look, people actually will come in and get into the pool. It's kind of funny. <laughs> I feel like the only one that doesn't have The Sims 4. I'm sure you're not the only one. Do you have a Mac? Is that why you don't have it? Or you just don't have it on the PC? Because, like, you don't have the money for it. Alright, and let's go ahead and let her come and sit on the side of the pool when she's ready. See, they will come and get in. It's kind of cool. So you can come over here and sit here. Shouldn't the lights be turning on here? Turn on all lights. Set the intensity and color. Let's see. For all lights. Let's do this. Uh this all the way up. There we go. So there she is, pregnant and all at the pool. And I think he can still splash her from inside the pool. Uh oh, he better calm down or he's going to get himself in some trouble. <laughs> yeah, so he can still splash her from her sitting on the side of the pool, him being in there. Um, I don't no, if she can splash him without getting into the pool. Yeah, she can't actually splash him, but he can splash her. I'll show you guys again. <laughs> there it is. Swimming. You don't have the money for it. That's, you know, that's understandable. I don't expect everyone to be able to have it, so... I'm sure you're not the only one, though. Look at her little belly. <laughs> She's so cute with her little belly. 
All right, so it's 9.44. They're looking pretty tired, so I think I'm going to go ahead and let them go home. They got to swim, and when we come back, we can do more with the swimming and stuff in the daytime more because, you know, it's dark right now, and they're not really into it. So let's go ahead and let them travel together back home. So we're going to travel with Derek, and we'll go back home. All right. So there they are. They're swimming. Do you have a new slot special for swimming attire? Yeah, it goes in with the outfits where you make like all their outfits. There's a swimming one now, so you have to like set their swimming attire. I did it at the beginning of this video, so if you want to see it, um, this when this goes up on YouTube, you'll be able to see it. You might get it for Christmas. Well, that's cool. That's a good present. Yeah, I play The Sims 4, The Sims 3, The Sims 2. I play them all. It doesn't matter to me which one I play. All right, let's go ahead and let you guys get to bed because you guys are tired. Tired? All right, and you go ahead and sleep. So there we are. They're going to bed. It was a nice day at the park. And that way, at the park, you know, you can see other people go swimming. They do get this really cool moodlet which says, Relaxing swim, a good swim is a great way to relax and relieve some stress. And I think she's on trimester two now. Yep, third trimester in 22 hours. So in less than a day, we'll be getting ready to have a baby. That'll be some exciting times. All right, let's get you to use the bathroom. I'm going to get you to go ahead and grab some of the scrambled eggs. You're going to grab the scrambled eggs because she's really got to pee. She's getting bigger. And then when you're done, I'll let you go to the bathroom. And then how long until you have to work? Two hours? Okay, we'll just let you. We keep forgetting to have him do his programming skill, but I was trying to show you guys the swimming a little bit. And it's nice that you can just build it on like that. It's a lot easier. So we're up to three friends of the four that we need. We could try and make another friend, but she's got work in 12 hours, and I'm not really ready to force her. But today we're going to go jogging with her so she doesn't gain a lot of weight from the pregnancy. Along with a new laptop. Man, that is some heck of present. You must have been really good this year. <laughs> um... You're far too uncomfortable to do this. Well, once you eat, you won't be too uncomfortable. Um, yeah, we know you're not good. Um, so, yeah, The Sims 3, I mean, it's pretty good. Is she pregnant? Yes. <laughs> She's pregnant. She's not that hefty. She's actually a teeny tiny little thing, so she's really big for being so small. What? Serve breakfast. I don't even know why that came up when I clicked on you. You're right, you need to go jogging when you're done. And you are going to take your shower because you got to go to work in 53 minutes. And we need money because we have a baby on the way. And also, we need to build a computer room for you to be able to continue on with your, your job. She's working hard on hers, at least. That's a good thing. She does need to practice some music, so maybe before she goes to work today, we'll head to the museum and play the piano a little bit again. That way we've got that done. Oh, no, you just broke the shower. Repair that thing before work, please. All right, so let's speed her up a little bit. She's taking a little bit too long for me. I don't know why she's so uncomfortable. I mean, oh, the morning sickness is killing her. All right, well, she's got to go, she's got to go jog. She's acquired the fitness skill. This is jogging. <laughs> oh, my God. She waddles to jog. That's, it's the waddling jog. That's what we call it. It's a new, a new form of working out. <laughs> is this really how she's working out? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Derek, fix the shower. <laughs> I think he has to go to work now. She looks so miserable. Look at her. She's like, I hate my life. I hate being pregnant. This is the worst time of my life. 
<laughs> oh my goodness. Poor girl. Making her work out. She's got to work out, though. I've not seen them, like, just walk, though. It's kind of funny. Derek's new skill and handiness will allow him to salvage parts from piles of junk and repair broken objects. And he just finished repairing the shower, too. I don't know why. She's... She's just waddling. It's too funny. <laughs> she just waddles. I don't know. I don't really understand. This is that other girl we were talking to. The Clarissa Stoner girl. There she is. <laughs> She's ridiculous. Who's this guy? Vance Suggs. Alright, Vance. Vance. Okay. Oh my goodness, this is hilarious. Can you actually jog now? Nope. No jogging be happening with her. She's like, forget it. It's out of the question. Alright, we're not going for another jog then, because you're taking too long to do this first one. Alright, let's travel. Uh -huh. She has 15 hours before third trimester. No. We're not chatting with Atticus. I don't even know who that is, but we're not chatting with them. All right, let's go to play the piano at the museum. We'll get that done for work today because we didn't work on it yet, and that's not good. Is she in the third trimester and about to burst? No, she's in second trimester. So I don't really understand. I've had my sims literally jog up until the moment they gave birth. I don't know why she's waddling it out, but she must have been feeling lazy or something. I don't know. Alright, let's put these walls down. And let's go play. Let's go practice this. If she jogs over there to the piano, I would laugh. Nope, she's gonna waddle. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why she's like waddling so soon. Normally my sims don't do this until the third trimester. Maybe it's because she's so tiny. I don't know. She is carrying a lot of baby weight. Makes me wonder if she's... Oh my gosh, there's that girl again. She's going to have twins just because she's so huge. Plus also because she won't jog. So. Alright, so here we go. Play some music for work. That's what we got to do. So she should have the baby around, like, let's say, Saturday or Sunday. Yeah, around Saturday-ish, probably. Belly bump. How much longer will you stream? Um, for a little while, at least. It's only 8.34 here for me, so... I got lots going on. Yeah, it's only 8.30 for me here, so it's not that late. How far is she done with this? 25? Alright, let's speed her up. She's not the greatest. I can tell you that much. Uh, she's 50% done. Seventy-five. So about eleven o'clock a.m. She should be done. Yep, she's done. All right, let's stop playing the piano. You have to pee again. Sheesh. Go to the bathroom. Goodness, girl. You got more issues than I know what to do with, my friend. I should probably let her take a shower before she goes to work. But I'm going to try and make this redheaded girl my friend before we go to work. I don't remember her name. That's why I called her the redheaded girl. Clarissa. Let's tell her a funny story. Um, heartfelt compliment. Uh, deep conversation. Brighten her day. What is up with all these people? I don't know. 
discuss interest. It shouldn't take too long before she's our friend, so that's what I'm thinking. We should be able to do it pretty quickly. How can you talk like that? You're like talking to someone behind you. Goofball. I don't care about you. I don't care about you. Okay, we're friends. See, look at that. All right, we need to go get her. we need to get her home and have her eat something. So let's let her stop doing this. We're gonna have her travel back home. Go home. She is very happy. Not gonna be very happy if she doesn't get some food soon. Okay, here we go. How many hours till the baby? Let's check. Ten more hours. So about. Not even, like, 10 o'clock tonight, she should be in the third trimester. It's 8.34 here, too. Nice. When Sims are pregnant, they tend to pee and eat a whole lot more. Yeah, they pee a lot, let me tell you. She wasn't even that bad, and she was having a fit about it, so... Why is she invisible all the time? Maybe that's her way of saying she doesn't want to be seen pregnant anymore. With this huge belly. Which is very huge. Okay, let's get you some food. Go ahead and... Grab a serving of that, and then clean out the fridge. And then I'm going to let you take a shower before you go to work as well. Which I hate that they have to work while they're pregnant. I really hate that. I think they should change that so they don't have to work anymore. Oh, take a shower when you're done. Well, huh. Like I liked when I got my days off. I could work on my job performance or, you know, work on anything that I wanted to do when they didn't have to go to work all the time. I don't know. Just like what I like to do. All right. We need some money. And we got bills coming up soon, too. Which is never good. Bills are always so expensive in this game. I bet you we have to pay like 500 about 500 simoleons for this house. It's going to be expensive. Yeah, and humans. <laughs> ah. I don't know. I've never been pregnant, so I don't know. Only time I've ever really been around a pregnant person was when my mom was pregnant with my little brother, and I was eight, so I wasn't really paying attention to how often she ate or went to the bathroom. Okay, when you're done in there, let's get you to mop up this floor. At least get something done today. She still has three more hours. This is crazy. You know what? I should have gotten her inspired because she needs to go to work inspired. Well, let's just let her mop up the floor. And then I'm going to let her pee. Oh, Derek's home with 152 simoleons today. Derek, come dig through this. Alright, let's get you inspired. Which one is inspiring? Take a thoughtful shower, just real quick. It won't take five seconds. Oh, we didn't buy them a garbage can. We need to buy them a garbage can so he can throw this out. Alright, oh, the lady's at our door. You can go ahead and share the big news with her. She's your friend. Go ahead and let's buy a trash can really quick. Alright, this teddy bear may have to move. Mr. Teddy! This house is going to be really tiny if we have a baby and we're still living in this small of a home. 
All right, trash can it is. Let's get a small trash can. Not that one. No one's ugly. No, I want a black one. Black trash can. Come on. There we go. 55 simoleons. Holy shimokas. All right. Derek, go ahead and clean this up, please. Throw that away. Thanks, friend. And let's try and get him to upgrade something, because actually we're going to take him out when she goes to work, but she's going to go to work for two hours. And she's going to be inspired for four, so it's good. Let's go ahead and let him... Oh, he can't upgrade anything yet? Oh, that's sad. He actually needs to eat, though. So let's go ahead and let him have some salad. Salad. How much longer? Seven hours. You should probably eat again before you go. Stop talking to this lady. Stop talking to the lady and go eat! Yes, I do. It's G Baby Challenger. Lady, put my book back. Uh -huh. Alright, you need to go to work soon. Hurry up. Derek wants to get out of here. He doesn't want to be here any longer. Derek, you do need to pee, though. So go use that. Take a shower while you wait for your wife to leave to go to work so we can take you out to the library so you can use the computer. 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 Lady, we need to eat before we go to work. Stop talking to us. She's got eight minutes before she goes to work. Alright, she's off. Derek is going to ask this lady to leave. He wants to group around to someone. That's ridiculous. Okay. Ask her to leave and then clean this up. Stop putting the books all over the friggin' house. Keep the books in the bookshelf. Okay. Clean that up and then we're gonna travel. Alright, let's go to the library. The library! We'll go to the library and get him to work on his job. Which is over in... This is why I normally I live in Willow Creek, because everything that I need is normally over here. Like, if I need a computer, it's over here. If I need this, it's over here. If I need this, it's over here. That's why normally I just stick in this town because it's a lot easier than traveling back and forth, but it's a nice a nice change of scenery to go to where we are now. Alright. What does he need to do? Browse the intelligence database and reach level two of programming. Alright, you're going to have to kick someone off. What is up with all the bald men on the computers today? Okay, let's practicing. Let's practice programming. Whoops. Love how you just, like, kick them off. Okay, so we're going to get this done. I don't know how this is already checked, but okay. Brush you Wymuck. Oh, Alexander is really sad. <laughs> Alright, so we're up to programming skill level 1. He'll be able... The programming skill will allow him to hack and practice programming. The higher the level of the skill, the more hacking opportunities will emerge. 
Okay. And one more skill level in this, and then we will switch over to browsing the intelligence database until Miss Thang gets home, and then we'll head home and spend some time with her. Which, I don't know when she gets home, to be honest. Okay, are you done? No. Lillian, stop. Alright. Come on. There we go. That's what we need you to do. Okay, stop doing that. Let's go ahead and browse the intelligence database. And then you should be ready for a uh, promotion tomorrow of whatever your next day of work is. Three days from now. Oh, great. At least he'll be home the first couple of days with a baby. That'll be good. What do you want to do? Work out? Suggest fun activities to someone. Too much intelligence. There's an eye-glazing amount of information in that database. Well, you're yeah. just going to have to learn to live no. with this because yeah. there's nothing I can do for you there. Okay, you should be done. Cheryl brought home 216 simoleons today. Alright, let's get you to go home. Are you done? Yes, you're done. All right, let's travel. Let's go back home. You wonder if the baby will have red or blonde hair. Washroom break. Um, yeah, me too. And I wonder if it's going to be a boy or a girl. I'm really hoping for a boy, but if it's a girl, it's fine. Okay. Welcome back. Did you guys find my YouTube channel okay? Okay. Back home. She's getting in bed. <laughs> she just lost her mind. She's like, I'm home from work and she's not here. I can get in bed whenever I want. Um, no, you're going to get back up. We're going to take care of your other needs first, and then I'll let you go to bed. So let's get you to use the toilet and eat some dinner. Because if I don't have you do that, you know you're going to be complaining in the middle of the night that you've got to go pee. So let's get you up to do that. And then what do you need to do? You need fun. You are just a bucket of fun, aren't you? All right. You're not that exhausted, Cheryl, where you need to go to bed right this minute. Uh, yeah. You're gonna sub to my YouTube channel when you get the chance. All right. Thank you. I do a lot of different stuff on there. Um, so I'm sure you'll find something that you like at least. And I always put these live streams up there, so if you ever miss them, you can always catch them there as well. That's the good thing about that. Alright, so let's get you some fun. You really need to eat. Come on. And I knew that was going to be the last bowl, so he was not going to get any before he went to bed, which is horrible. Alright, once you're done eating, Cheryl, you can go to sleep. And Derek... I'm going to get you to stop. I'm going to get you to clean up the dishes. Alright, I'm also going to let you use. And then you can go to sleep. Oh, stop it. Just go use the bathroom. I think the relationship's slipping because we haven't... Not, not that bad, actually. But it is a little bit because we haven't really been having them talk much. They've been working on other things. Actually, let's not even worry about that. Let's just go to sleep. Are you back again, Amy? Alright, you've got to worry about this one. Repair it. And then you got to clean this. 
Uh, these days I don't worry about this one is because I was going to replace it, but now, since you broke that one and had to repair it anyways, you might as well come repair this one too. You got one common upgrade part from that. Okay, scavenge for parts from that as well. He's reached level 2 of the handiness skill. He can now perform basic upgrades on plumbing objects and craft furniture at a woodworking table. He can also talk about handiness with other sims and purchase upgrade parts on the computer. Snippity snap. Perfect. Alright, so let's get you to do this. So maybe tomorrow we'll have him upgrade some things. Plumbing upgrade part? Okay. Um, let's go ahead and have you scavenge for parts here. And then I'm going to get you to throw the piles of trash away. Alright, go ahead and throw them away. And then go to sleep. And then hopefully you'll get enough rest tomorrow. And then we'll have you work on upgrading stuff around the house. Alright, there we go. Speed up. Yay, cheetah speed. Well, you love The Sims, so there's nothing you like. There's something I like. Yeah. <laughs> there's a lot of Sims up there. From Sims 2 to Sims 4. So I'm sure you can find something. Alright, go ahead and use. <sighs> what time is it? 529. How much before work? 12 hours. Go back to bed, lady. What are you up this early for? Oh yeah, and she didn't start music again. So we're going to have to go to the museum and have her work on her music a little bit. Okay, there we go. And we need someone to cook some breakfast, because I don't think we have any food left in the fridge. That's not good. That's not good at all. Alright, so Cheryl, when you're done, let's go ahead and have you serve breakfast, make up some scrambled eggs. Derek, when you're done sleeping, it's going to be a little bit before you're up, so I'm going to let you keep sleeping. Alright, let's see how much time she has before she... Ooh, she's got question mark, question mark, question mark. She can go at any time. Look how freaking big she is. Oh my goodness. She's huge. Alright, so she's up to cooking skill level 2. She's learned the recipe for eggs and toast, BLT, chips and salsa, and fish tacos. She also learned a cool new combo add trick move. Okay. So let's just get breakfast going. Let's just get this done so that she can eat this. Yep. Grab a plate and then you can go to Pelic Champion. And he can get up and grab a plate. Grab a serving. And I'm also going to get you to put this away. Oh, her back hurts. And then you can use... And we have not been having her jog. Shoot. Uh, let's go ahead and get you to jog. And since she has time, before she takes a shower, I'm going to let her go jogging. Oh, yeah. No wonder why I didn't have her go jogging. She was, like, crazy. Um, I won You wonder about the crafting furniture. Skip music today, but work hard at work. And let Derek upgrade the bathroom stuff. Do you watch the show Once Upon a Time? Yes, I do, and I love it. I'm a little bit behind, though. Um, skip music today. Well, it's not going to take too long, and that way that we can get out of the house, too. Unless you guys don't want to go back, travel back to the museum. We need to just buy her a guitar. I don't even know how much the guitars are, to be honest. I know the pianos are really expensive. But she's got to go jogging a little bit before, you know, work. And then when she's done jogging, I'll let her come home and take her shower. So she doesn't really need a shower. She needs more fun than anything. But she will after she goes jogging. Borb. You can go in the bathroom. I don't know what he was having a fit about. Alright, and then I'll let you take a shower too. Is she actually jogging? Oh my goodness, look how big she is. <laughs> and no, she's not. She's waddling. She's huge. Um... You love it too, and don't worry, you're behind too. Once Upon a Time looks like Frozen, just from the cover. 
in your opinion. Well, they have the Frozen characters in it. If that's what you're talking about, the movie Frozen, then they have the characters in it. Elsa and Anna are in there, and Kristoff, and the reindeer. I can't remember the reindeer's name. <laughs> She's just ridiculous. I can't believe this is a jog for a pregnant lady. Like, why is she jogging like this? It's ridiculous. All right, let's go jog with Derek, because at least he's jogging. <laughs> He's so tiny. But this does give him fun, too, so that's good. I'm going to make him go one more time, just because I'm mean like that. Plus, it keeps him fit. Sven. That's what it is. There you go. So you guys are on top of this stuff better than I am. <laughs> She's so slow. <laughs> We're, like, going to be all the way back home before she gets there. She's, it's so sad. Um, all right. Is she seriously still going? Oh my goodness. All right, well, pregnant lady on the move. Don't watch out now. Look at her, and she's just... She's lost her mind. She doesn't know where she's going. Derek hasn't been mean to anyone. we got to make another enemy now. And we need to buy a toy and tell a joke. I don't know about that, guys. Is she done working out now? And watch. She didn't go home, so I'm going to have to, like, get her to walk all the way back home, probably. Is she home? Well, she's out front of the house. All right, let's go ahead and let you... Is, what is he doing? He's using the bathroom. So you're going to come up here and just play chess. Her needs go down so fast. It's so oh, horrible. <laughs> okay. All right, so we'll just let you play this. <laughs> Alrighty then. Huh. And you need fun and social. You should probably talk with your wife. When does she have to go to work? Four hours? Uh -huh. And she needs to be inspired for work. So let's get her inspired. Let's go ahead and let you pee like a champion. Um... And when you're done with that, I'm going to let you come over here. You're going to upgrade this to Sturdy Faucets. Whatever you say, Derek. Whatever you say. Okay. So when she's got about two and a half hours left, I'll probably have her go to the bathroom and stuff. And actually, I'm going to do it probably pretty oh, soon because ah. I want her to eat before she goes again. Just because if she doesn't, she'll be starving when she gets home. How old are you, if you don't mind me asking? I am 24. <laughs> My husband's yelling down the hallway. <laughs> All right, let's get you off of here. Let's get you to use... I'm going to get you inspired for work so that you'll be in the proper mood. So let's go ahead and let you take a thoughtful shower. And then, depending who finishes their things first, someone's going to have to make autumn salad or something for lunch and dinner. So we'll see who can come up with <laughs> the end of their, two ta their tasks first. She's going to wash her hands. She's so close that we don't really need to play the music, but she at least needs to be inspired. Someone's at my door. Who's this lady? She's been here twice now. Ashlyn Person. Ashlyn, once we get this promotion, we're not going to really need you as a friend anymore. All right, Derek, you finish first. All right, come make some salad, please. 
So cook up some autumn or garden salad. Let's make the party size. It's fast. You're 16? Nice. I remember being that young. Alright. I'm going to let you come sit down. Sit on the chair. What? What? Oh, his telephone's ringing. Don Monterio would like to come over and hang out. Okay. Lillian, stop. Max is favored a lot. Pools. That's what it's called. Oh, goodness. Alright. While you're cooking, why don't you talk with your wife? Um, why don't you ask the baby's due date? Kalanginsula? You can go ahead and Yeah, just make up the salad. Come on now, friend. And what do you need now? Fun and social. Oh, Don Monterio is here, so you should probably invite him in. Oh, that that counter is disgusting. Do I have a bird screaming? <laughs> yes. You're watching this because your driver's test is tomorrow afternoon and you're so nervous. Well, good luck. I don't have my driver's license or anything like that, so good luck on that. Um, yeah. I wish I did, but I don't. All right, let me go ahead and get her to eat before she has to go to work in 57 minutes, so stop talking. Go ahead and grab a serving. Is Derek even hungry? I don't think he's even hungry. He just made it and doesn't really need to eat it. So why don't you come out here and why don't you ask him about his day? And then you guys can you can join the game that he's playing as well. So that way you're getting fun and social. Yay! And Cheryl, when you're done eating, can you put this away, please? Oh, we gotta fix that double ring thing on his hands. That is ridiculous. One ring is plenty, Derek. He wants to let all the ladies know he's taken. Is it for your your driver's test? So like you have to drive the cars? Oh goodness. Or do you mean like your um your permit test? I think you mean your permit test. Sixteen permit. It's got to be permit. I think. I had my permit once. It expired because I went to college and wasn't prepared for going to college and working on being home so I could learn to drive. That's what happened. I'll get in it again soon, someday. It's actually not that bad. Just remember, like, the big things. Did you take some of, like, the the tests online or whatever? Because they help, too, to help you know what's good and bad to know about them. Alright, she's gotta go to work. Is she still inspired? She is still inspired. Okay, they need to stop with that thing. They are go crazy. Um, yeah, you need to get your permit. Yeah. Once you get the permit, you'll be really excited, but, uh, I was really excited to drive too, and it's not as hard as people make it out to be, to drive, but I just didn't get my 40, I didn't get my 40 hours or whatever in, so I didn't get to get my license, and I don't have a car right now, so I can't really, can't really learn, but I will someday. Alright, how are you doing on needs? Alright, I'm gonna speed you up. She'll probably come home from work and either early or like right after work and give birth, so it shouldn't be too much longer. He's up to logic skill level 3, he has a chance to gain slightly more logic skill from the chess and card tables than normal. 
What is this man doing? He just like left me out here. Alright, I'm going to let you go to the bathroom. And then I'm going to let you eat. Because it is dinner time now. Even though I'm, you know, whatevs. Lucky Palms Resort. Okay, so it looks like Don is leaving. When you're done with that, we don't have enough to upgrade this. Shoot. That's sad. Work hard for promotion. Uh, I don't think she's going to have to work hard. It just Once she was inspired, that's what boosted her. So she should be good. She should get it. Uh, let's see. And I don't want to stress her out because she's really, she's pregnant, so I don't want to stress her out too much. All right, let's admire yourself in the mirror. I'm going to speed you up so you're not so slow. I don't even know. Do you guys know? I wish you could just hover over her and see, like, when she was going to be home. Instead of it just saying, at work. Which, obviously, we know you're at work. Make a friend, buy a toy, make an enemy. That's all you want to do with your life. You're ridiculous. Um, Put this book away. And... Nothing is in the mail because it's Saturday. Hmm. We need to find something fun for you to do. So I guess you can just come out here and play some more chess. Oh, he's focused. Alright, it's about 11 o'clock. I'm going to let him go to sleep so time will naturally speed up. Um, 11? What would you name the baby if it's a boy? He should be named Austin, and if it's a girl, she should be named Allie. 11 is when she's home. I think boy, William, girl, Sophia. Alright, so she did get her promotion to the C-lister... She got our additional four simoleons an hour for 40 simoleons an hour. 541 is a, as a uh, bonus. The Sim Idol Rug. Her next shift is Sunday at 5 p.m. to 11 p.m. And she now has Tuesdays and Wednesdays off. I don't... Well, if you guys know the original Millmans, you would know that if it's a boy, it's going to be named with a D name, and if it's a girl, it's going to be named with a C name, because that's how I always did their their kids. All right, let's see what that rug is. Ooh, fancy. I don't really know where I'd put this. There we go. Put it at our front door. So we're cool like that. All right. Let's go ahead and buy a couple things. I want to buy a rug for the baby room before the baby gets here. And my favorite one is this little thing right here. And I usually get it in like the yellow and green. There. So the baby's got a little um, thing. Let's give it a couple of things for its wall as well. Just because it's got very plain walls. Like very plain walls. So we'll do those two pictures over there. And we'll do these two over here. Alright. Let's take this one. We'll put it like that. Be a little bit different. Okay. Um, We need to build a computer room now. Um, Daniel or Damon... You're going to watch Disney till you die. <laughs> um, so Carrie or Caitlin for a girl. Or Donnie or Desmond for a boy. You guys are giving me lots of good ones. Um, Alright, let's do... Let's build an office for him. Uh, we've got bills coming though. Let's hold off on the office, just because we've got bills coming, and I don't know how much they're going to be. Alright, what does she need the most? She needs to use the bathroom, and then she needs to go to sleep. Oh, she's gone into labor. 
Ho! Oh. <laughs> She's bursting with anticipation to meet her new bundle of joy. Uh, oh, oh. Alright. All right, there we go. Let's get her to bed so she can just sleep through the pregnancy. Then when she wakes up and gives us a little birth, then we'll let her eat. So that way we're getting her through this. All right, I'm gonna pause just quickly because I need to do something really, really quick. Hold on. Um, I have a paper around here somewhere that so has their Hold on, guys. It has their traits on it that I wrote down when I created them. Because I'm going to show you what we're going to do. And it's going to make it really fun. You guys are going to love it. Man, that's not it. What the heck? Um, hold on. You too. All right, maybe this is it. Hold on. Labor, but first, let me pee. <laughs> yeah, they gotta pee once in a while. All right, here it is. All right, let's go ahead and go with this. Okay, here comes the baby. <laughs> All right, put your boats in. Gonna give you five seconds. Put your votes in, and then we're gonna let her have the baby. I think it's a boy. What do you guys think it is? Votes, votes, votes. You guys want me to save? Yeah, I will after the baby's born. I wanna see what you guys think it's gonna be. girl okay we got a girl hey anyone else got any ideas boy you think a boy you think a boy okay here we go oh here we go It's a boy! <laughs> Alright, so let's see. You guys gave me some names. You gave me Daniel, Damon, Donnie, and Desmond. Okay. Um. <laughs> you voted girl. Um. We're going to name him... Donnie. Donnie Millman. Um, boy, he needs a name. Okay, there we go. There he is. What are his traits? Did we not get to choose traits for him? That's sad. Alright, let's go ahead and let you use. And let's go ahead and let you open this up. Grab a serving of the scrambled eggs. And then head back to sleep. Does he need anything? I don't even know. I can't tell. You said that name earlier. Yeah. Has to start with a D. Yep, has to start with a D, guys. Oh, we don't get to choose yet? Shoot. I was really excited. I wanted to choose some traits for him. Alright, well. 
was worth a try. Unknown trait. Yeah, we should have gotten to choose a trait for him. That was weird. I thought we could. But it says unknown. I don't know. Before she goes to bed, she does need to feed him, though. So let's go ahead and let her breastfeed him. And then we'll let her go to sleep. Oh, he's sleeping now. Never mind. I'm not going to wake a break sleeping baby. Just go to sleep there, Cheryl. All right, let's go ahead and save. Sheesh, it's like one person goes to bed and another one wakes. And girl has to start with C. Yes. Guadalupe. I never even thought about naming my kids that. So how this works is all the boys that they have will be named D's and all the girls that they have will na be named C's. And then say, you know, Donnie here ages up and marries someone with the name of M, then their kids will be D for boy and M for girl. So you see like the pattern. And you'll get, you know, multiple different kinds of names. It'll be fun. It'll, you'll get to see it pass down through the generations and... After a while, you can name them like juniors as well if you wanted to. It's up to you guys what you guys want to do. But I'm going to write down all of your guys' ideas. So grab a serving. So let me make start making a list of uh, names that you guys give me for this. Oh, man. Um, you chose the trait. You choose the trait when he is a kid. Okay. That's fine. All right, let's go ahead and write down the names that you guys said. So you guys said Daniel. And Desmond. And I'm going to have to scroll back up and see what you else you guys said. Mmm. Donnie, Desmond, Daniel, Damien. Okay, and then for girls, you gave me Carrie, Caitlin. Okay. So as we go, I'll take down your guys' your guys' names, but Okay. Let's go ahead and clean this up. No, clean it up. He's like, if I drop it again, she might not realize. Yes, I did. Another boy named is Danny. All right, Danny. Is this the baby challenge or something? Could be. Pretty much. Um, no, it's not the baby challenge, but it's kind of a challenge in its own. Um, okay. We haven't gotten into the challenge yet, but you guys will you'll find out more about that in a bit. All right, let's go ahead and get little man fed because he wasn't fed when he was born. We'll bounce him. We'll coo at him. Cuddle him. Uh, make a silly face, rock him, we'll talk to him, and then when we're done, we'll probably change his diaper just to make sure everything is taken care of. We won't worry about anything. Hello. Another boy name is Baylor. Okay. I'll write it down, but we won't be able to use it until we have a boy. We marry into a boy that has that name. But we can write it down. Oh, you got a lot of them. Declan, Duke, Dexter, Dustin, that's my brother's name, and Duncan. Man, you guys are good at this. Okay, we're going to need C names now for girls. Alright, so you take care of your son. This will get your guys' relationship up as well. Oh, 
<laughs> All right. Cheryl is sleeping for a long time. She was up in the middle of the night, though, so that makes sense. She has work in 11 hours. She's got plenty of time. And she needs... Oh, she's already achieved level 3 of the guitar comedy skill, so that's good. And she just needs to practice music for her work, so that's another good thing. He should get a job... He should get a promotion when he gets there. Let's go ahead and have you just change the diaper really quickly. It shouldn't take you only 5 seconds. Alright, I'm going to let you go jogging. Since the baby is well taken care of. And then we'll go from there. Also, I'm going to be randomizing for... Well, I'm going to be allowing you guys to choose favorite colors for everyone. So, like, Derek's favorite color is obviously red. Cheryl's is purple. But what favorite color do you want Donnie to have? That way we'll dress him in that. And we'll build, like, his whole entire thing around that color. Um, Kathy? Violet blue? I don't even know what kind of color that is. Hi! You got Katie. You guys are just popping these in here quick. We already have a Donnie, just spelled with an I-E. Um, oh, Connie. That's a good one, actually. All right. Connie, Candy, <laughs> Catherine. Oh, my goodness. You guys are good. Catherine, Cassidy. Oh, gosh. You guys are going fast. <laughs> Cassidy, blue, orange or blue, yellow, orange, orange, blue. <laughs> you guys are so funny. Aqua, teal. Oh my goodness, you're really getting into it now. All right, so let me take a tally of who wants what. Gonna need another piece of paper for this because this is gonna be a lot of tallying. All right, so we have all colors are blue. Hold on, guys. All right. Let's see. Blue, we've got one, two. We've got one for orange. Then there's yellow. Hold on. Another for orange. Or orange. Okay. Then you've got another for blue. We've got teal. Aqua, and my husband's saying violet blue. I don't even know what color that is, but okay. All right. Man, you guys are still popping out names. All right, let's see. More names you guys have. Carly. I have to make sure all these aren't on here. Camille. Corinne, uh, Caitlin, we have a Caitlin, uh, Capri, <laughs> Callie, oh my goodness, okay, okay, <laughs> Camille again, um, all right, let's have you go to the bathroom, Candice, Chelsea, Callie, got a Callie, Chloe, okay, you guys got a lot here, Charlotte, what are we voting on for colors? The baby's favorite color, what his favorite color would be, we'll dress him in those colors, Chloe, Karina. All right, I think that's good, guys, on names. But thank you for all the names. Cora. Man, <laughs> you guys just keep bringing them. <laughs> we have double what we have for the boys now. <laughs> all right, we got to have kids to be able to name them. So <laughs> let's, let's hold up on the naming now. All right, how's the baby doing? I think he's okay. All right, Mom, are you ever going to get up out of bed today? Like, seriously. Go and use the bathroom. What time is it? 9.30 in the morning? Go ahead and grab some scrambled eggs. She did not gain an ounce. Do you realize this? She is one lucky duck. And since she doesn't have to work for a while, I'm going to let her go jogging just once, and then I'm going to let her come home and take a shower. 
And Dad, what do you need to do? He needs to hug someone and make an enemy and buy a toy. That's all he wants to do. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's crazy. Alright, can you upgrade this yet? No, because we need more parts. 22 hours. So tomorrow you go to work. You became a parent, so we completed that for you. You need to read to a child for three total hours and socialize with your child for 20... Socialize with your child 20 times. Oh gosh, that's a lot of times. All right. Let's go ahead and let's get you to talk with your wife. Let's reveal your deep secret with her. Once upon a time reference. Okay. How long until Donnie is older? I don't know. How long do you want it to be until he's older? <laughs> he was just born. <laughs> um, a few days. And how much was that rug? This rug? Or this rug? <laughs> that could take a while. Oh! Baby's not happy. Change your diaper. Give him a bottle. Bounce him. Coo at him. Cuddle him, make a silly face, rock him, and talk to him. There we go. The Hollywood one? We got that for free. Uh, you can just age them up. Cora is Regina's mom's name in Once Upon a Time. Yes, it is. Um... I don't know. I can try and see in buy mode if you can figure out how much it's worth. 172 simoleons. Can you actually buy it in here, though? Let's look. Oh, right here. Yeah, you can. It's 215. Yeah, but how much money was it? It's worth 175, but it's 215 for here. Alright, when he's done taking care of Donnie, let's go ahead and let him clean this up. So has, any, has everyone voted? You're cool? Thank you. <laughs> She's reached fitness level 2. Alright. Um... She needs fun, and I think she gets fun from playing the piano, so I think we should let her go do that. Plus, she needs to reach level 4 in another skill, and I think she's level 3 on the piano already. Oh, she's almost level 3. She's level 2. So we'll let her put up her piano, and we'll do, like, charisma or something, or cooking, or something like that. Alright, so she's going to take her shower. And then maybe we'll have the parents go out together. Depends on how much time she has before work, too. Let's check and see how much she, time she has. Six hours? Yeah, we have plenty of time. Oh, that did not go well. All right, let's take the parents to the museum so she can play the piano for a little bit and get that skill up because she needs to do it for her aspiration. So we'll do that. All right, let's travel with Mr. Daniel. Or Derek, excuse me. <laughs> Mr. Daniel. Um, will I ever do face cam? Maybe someday. I just don't have a face cam right now. Make Donnie a painter extraordinaire. They make a bunch of money and he will make tons of money for you guys as a teen. Blue, you haven't voted yet? You're welcome. <laughs> and when do you stream on a regular basis? I stream every Monday, but I stream today because I had a migraine headache this morning, so wasn't able to record my videos for my channel. So that's why I'm live streaming today. But I might do, start doing it more often than just every Monday. Do you know about the Aspiration Points Awards? Yeah, I do. Um, we were looking at one of them. I was looking at one of them earlier. Um, you want blue? It looks like he's gonna. His favorite color is gonna be blue.
I'm trying, I'm thinking I might start trying to do like an everyday kind of thing for the live streaming, but I don't know. Donnie was sent to daycare. That's okay. He'll be alright. He was taken care of us by us before we left him, so that's good. Alright, let's go ahead and have her practice, and... <clears throat> you want to buy a punching bag? Have you lost your mind? Let's make an enemy. Let's make an enemy with this man. Let's give him a rude introduction. <laughs> that's what you get for being bald, buddy. <laughs> um... Okay, because you're, you are a really cool swimmer. Oh, thank you. Oh goodness. Look <laughs> at all the people that just stream in here. It's ridiculous. What the heck? His arms went through him. I think he has some special abilities, so we've got to be mean to him. He's so funny. All right, be mean. And mock his outfit. Go ahead and be mean and jeer. And let's see, be do some mischief stuff. Uh, trick him with a hand buzzer. And be mean and imply his mother is a llama. <laughs> and then go ahead and bite him. Oh, he just buzzed himself, but a dork. Huh? <laughs> Good night. Thanks for coming. Hi. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Niceness. Beat him. Get him. Uh oh. <laughs> we got him. We got him. <laughs> Yeah, we won. We the wieners. Declare them the enemy. They now despise each other. Well, now he's my enemy. So don't worry about it, friends. Very confident. Triumphant. <laughs> Alright, what does he want to do? Show off his muscles to someone? Alright, show it off to this guy. Show off your muscles. Oh, you gotta do a friendly introduction. Seriously? Alright, can you show off your muscles to her? Friendly. Uh, show off your muscles. <laughs> He's like, look at these suckers. This is what beat this big boy. <laughs> he wants to apologize to him now? Is he crazy? He lost his mind or something. Be friendly. How can you apologize? <laughs> you can try to calm him down. Um. Okay. Be mean, and then we'll try to apologize. So, why don't you jeer him? Now he wants to make a friend. Okay, can you apologize now? <laughs> I have no idea. If you mean again, I don't think it worked. Mock his outfit. Do I own some three? Yes. Yeah, I'll stream it if you guys want me to. Beg forgiveness? I don't think so, buddy. You wanted to apologize and I can't get that to come up, so I don't really know what you want to do. Alright, you want to make a friend, buy a toy, we're not apologizing to him because we can't find the action, so. Can you make friends with people by, like, you can't, like, watch her play? Guess not. Is she done with that thing for her work? Yeah, she's done with it, so let's let her get off of here. She wants to flirt with Derek. All right, Derek, stop talking with this man, because all you guys are doing is just making things worse. Can you apologize to him yet? <laughs> no. All right, she wants to flirt with you, so I'm going to let her do that. Go ahead and flirt. And you want to hug someone, so that's under friendly. Um, go ahead and hug him. Okay, you need to close your legs though. You are wearing a skirt. 
All right, there we go. We got two of her things done, and she's happy because she has cool key chords. Let's see, did she learn any songs yet? Plunk for inspiration. Play song. <gasps> Traditional. Play, ooh, The Lot of the Rising Sun. I love this one, and I think you guys will like it too. All right, what does he want to do? Meet someone? Make a friend. Forget it. Don't worry about it. Just go here. Do you need to do anything for work? No, you're good on that. Um, <laughs> Alright. He has to eat. Let's let him go use the bathroom, though, while we're here. This is my favorite song they can play on this game. Well, so far that I know of, anyways. like that song. Um, I know that song in real life, so it just makes it even better. Alright, so let's go ahead and get you in here. You need to do this. Oh. Embrace him, and then you want to call someone on the phone. I'm going to let you chat with someone. Let's let you chat with one of your friends. Chat with... Chat with... Ashlyn. You want to play video games? That's never going to happen. Alright, so you use the bathroom. You want to woo -woo with her? You can't do that. Okay. But we can go get you something to eat. And she's going to head off to work, so I'm not going to worry about getting her anything to eat. Let's go eat over here. Someone's got some food over here. We'll just go eat this person's food. It's spoiled in seven hours, so grab a serving now. Okay, and she's going to be off to work in just a second, so... She wants to level up in the piano scale. How high is she in the piano scale? She's almost level four, so that's pretty good. All right, and she's headed to work. Do you have Ann Simmers that you like to watch on YouTube? Um, I have quite a few that I like to watch. It's like calm and soothing. It is. Um, yeah, I watch, like, Urban Sims sometimes, um, Landros, Ryder Junkies are my friend, she just started up a channel recently, um, <laughs> there's quite a few other ones, I just can't think of them all off the top of my head, but mostly I don't have, like, a ton of time to do them, I don't have, like, a ton of time to sit down and watch them, so I kind of just watch, like, once in a while kind of how it is. I don't know. Uh, because my channel is really crazy with scheduling for videos, so what we spend most of my time doing is making my own videos. Why are you talking with this weird lady? Pearl McDonald. Eat your food. Alright. You want to meet someone new. Well, I don't think she's classified as new anymore because you talked to her. So let's try and meet someone new. Let's see if we can do that. Let's friendly introduction this person. Nope, you already know that person. Never mind. Um, 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 um. This is Nina Caliente. You can go friendly introduction her. She looks so angry. She always looks so angry. Gossip about neighbors. Oh yeah, because she is our neighbor, isn't she? I forgot. 
I don't think we really have any neighbors, so she has to be about us. You watch Urban Sims, Life Simmer, Fancy Simmer, and more. Holy schmuckies. I wish I knew how much our bills were going to be, so I could just be like, alright, we don't need to save that amount of money. But, I don't know. What are they doing? Fire her up. <laughs> oh, he is not happy about this good versus evil thing. You want to hip bump somebody? Then hip bump her. Who's this lady? She's got rainbow sneakers. I love when they do it with little kids, so it's really funny. Alright. Alright, and you want to buy a treadmill? Are you lost your mind? You're tired? Yeah. And you need to... Read to a child for three total hours. Socialize with your child 20 times. You're done with your work stuff. But I'm going to send you home. Because you have to work in 12 hours. And if you're that exhausted already, we might as well just get you to bed. Alright, let's get you home. Um... Okay, well, thank you for stopping in. Hi! If you want to, you can follow me on YouTube, and that's where this will be posted later after I'm done streaming. I'll post it up there. Um, my YouTube is GBaby Challenger, so feel free to follow me. Alright. As my son brought back from daycare. He has. Alright, he may be sleeping, but if you do not take care of these babies, they will drop and it won't tell you. So I'm going to wake him up, and I know that's really mean to do. But we're going to wake him up and take care of him. So bottle feed him, bounce him, coo at him, cuddle, make a silly face, rock, and talk. Must not be hungry. Okay. Well, you'll be fine, child. And when you're done, go ahead and change his diaper just before you go to bed. Alright, let's see. You work in 10 hours. You'll stay as long as you can. Okay. That's fine. Alright, so you're off to bed, he's asleep, and Miss Thang is at work, so time is speeding up. He should go up to level 3 in a couple of hours, 240 simoleons day at work. That's actually pretty good. Alright, let's go ahead and let her eat. She can eat some of the autumn salad. Then we'll let her use, and then I'll let her go to sleep. Okay, speed you up. Baby is awake. Okay. Alright. Here we go. You gotta watch it because it'll speed through when he's crying. Alright. Mom's getting up this time. She can go ahead and breastfeed, change his diaper, bounce him. Actually, don't change his diaper yet. Bounce him, coo at him, cuddle, make a silly face, rock, and talk. And then when you're done with all that, then you can change his diaper. What's that? Make a friend. Oh, you just made him your friend. Nice. That's good. You want to be friends with your kid. Alright, then go ahead and change his diaper. 
And then I'll get you back to bed. Um. Yep, you do need your rest. And like I said, good luck. Age him up like today or something and change his attire after he ages up. I don't know. Okay. You're up now. Let's get you to use. Let's get you to eat your breakfast. I'll let you go ahead and go jogging. How long before work? Actually, you don't have time to jog. Alright, just go ahead and take a shower and then we'll go from there. And he is back to sleeping again. Derek starts work in an hour. Okay. How good is your relationship with him? I think yours is much better than hers. Yeah, so it's a good thing she's going to have to take care of him for a little bit today. Get that relationship up with her son, and then we should be good there. And Dad's going to work in just a couple minutes, so... There we go. He's off to work. He should get a promotion, and Mom will be home with Donnie today. All right. Derek's off to work. Oh. Okay. Mom is up. She needs to eat, so let's let her eat some eggs. She can go ahead and use. She can go ahead and take a shower, and then we'll take care of the baby. We'll just take care of all of his needs again, because I'm sure he's getting to the point where he needs it again, so... This will just get him so he's not like, you know, gonna cry or anything. He might even cry before we get over to him. Okay. And today's bills, so we're gonna have to see how much they are. Uh, cuddle, let's see, cuddle, make a silly face. Rock, talk, and then we'll actually change his diaper. There we go. They should be putting up their relationship quite a bit. They're good friends! Yay! Alright, he's back asleep, and Mom needs fun, so I'm going to let her come outside and ponder moves. Actually, before you do that, let's clean up the plate. And we need to get the mail somehow. Actually, we're going to go to the museum really quickly and play... No, we're not. We're going to buy a guitar. Do you guys want to play guitar or violin? Let's play violin. Bum, bum, bum. 420. Do you guys want to play guitar or violin? Age him up. Yes, age him up and change his attire. <laughs> you guys are <laughs> crazy. Um, we'll age him up, but I gotta have dad here. And it's that on normal, so it shouldn't be too much longer before it's real birthday. Anyways. And we gotta make a room for him before we can age him. He doesn't even have a bed. And that would mean mom and dad would need a bed too, bedroom too, because can't really sleep there. Just keep on using the museums instead of buying one? Okay. All right, let's go to the museum then. Travel. Let's go play the piano again. And it's over here. And here. The bird is making a lot of noise. 
You guys probably can't hear him. Violin, guitar. <laughs> I guess that was the you couldn't decide between. <laughs> We'll still buy her an instrument, just, I don't know when we'll buy it, but let, right now let's just let her play the piano here. And Donnie was sent back to daycare. Alright, this way we'll get her through this. Once she's done, we can head back home. Okay. So I'm going to sit here and watch this while this is on fast forward. <laughs> She's very happy. Fifty percent done. Seventy-five. She's up to level four. So that's two of the four skills. Hold on. Uh, Dirk just got a promotion to agent handler with an additional two simoleons an hour for twenty-one per hour. He got a bonus of three hundred eighty-four. Uh, the Recognance Workshop and tan Tranquilizing Handshake Interaction. His new shift is Tuesday at 8 a.m. until 4 p.m. And he gets Saturday and Sunday off still. So there we go. All right, I think she's done. So I'm going to send her back home. Let's go ahead and travel. We're going to go back home because she's going to be going to work soon and Derek's home. So we're going to do stuff with him when we get home. Plus, we have over 2,000 simoleons now. So we should be able to build a baby room and a bed, hopefully a bedroom for the parents as well. I'd like to at least get both of those completed before we age the baby up. Two different people the same color. Oh, it is. I didn't realize that. <laughs> Um, check the workstation, age up. What's the workstation? What is it? Is that what you're saying? You want me to see what it is? Bills are 427 simoleons. So let's go ahead and pay the bills. Just we gotta get that done. Okay, 427 simoleons out of my pocket. Let's go ahead and quickly build some bedrooms for this family. They don't really have bedrooms. Well, they do, but this is going to stay the nursery, so I'm not going to use that as the bedroom. And this is, like, going to be the kitchen area for right now and dining room, so I'm just going to build two rooms that's going to be the parents' bedroom and then the kids' bedroom. So let's build the parents here. Let's do three... Um, let's do five... And we'll build it to, like, here. This will be a good parent bedroom. Okay. And then the kids' bedroom doesn't need to be as big. Oh, man, that's, like, all of our money. This is so hard because you guys let me do so much stuff so quickly, and it's so hard because you don't even have any money for him right now. All right, let's see. Can we put this on the outside? We can't even fit, fit this on the outside. It's horrible. Um, all right, we'll undo that. Let's go ahead and take this. I'm going to put this in the middle. No, I'm going to put it there. All right, um, we might have to wait a little bit, guys. Maybe until she gets back from work so we can buy beds and doors because, I mean, the parents' bed will fit in their bedroom, which is going to go over here. Like that. And then that'll give us all this open space, but the whole point is, is we also need... Another chair. 
and we need more doors like a door here and a door to get in there so once we get the doors and we get the ba the kid a bed we'll age him up but if she can't afford if we can't afford it tonight then we'll have to do it like next time they go to work because we have to get them rooms okay Cheryl should be going to work in just a bit anyway so I think she makes quite a bit of money she makes 40 an hour, so she should make enough for us to at least get the kid a bed and get a couple doors. Make the bedroom smaller for the parents. I will if we can't afford it tonight. But she's going to be going to bed in two hours. Yeah, so we should be okay. Let's go ahead and let her use this and she, her thing is still inspired so I'm gonna let her take a thoughtful shower she goes to work in an hour and then when she comes home we'll have some money at least for the house oh, 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 <laughs> all right he needs to reach level two in charisma and have three friends why are you playing this when you're starving you make no sense get in here and eat some salad and then let's get you to use Is he crying? No, he's sleeping. Alright, and then when you're done, let's go ahead and let you practice your speech. Is she going to get a promotion today? Probably not, right? Oh, she might, guys. She might get a promotion. That would be good. Check the workstation from the house of the inventory. Oh! Alright, let's check the workstation. Here we go. Computer desk. We'll put it in the parents' room. And then they've got their chair to go with it. There we go. Now we've got a computer desk. Now we've just got to get a computer. Look at that. Alright, and I'm also going to move some of these toys around too. Because we were trying to like squeeze them all in here. So let's put the teddy bear in here. Hold on. Let's alt him into the corner. There we go. Um, we'll put this little toy box in this room as well. Just because... We're, we'll put his bed here. And that should be good. The rest of this can stay in here. It's just the baby room. So there we go. Alright, and she's about to head to work. She should probably get a mo promotion, I think. She's like right there. She get the promotion, and then she'll be at a level 4 in her career, so that'll be good. And she'll get the bonus, hopefully. And he's focused. Cheryl's off to work. What's up? All right, here we go. He needs to get to level two of this. So hopefully we can do this. Whatever she gets at work, we can literally spend on fixing up the house a little bit more. So that should be good. Alright, he's done with that, so let's go ahead and let him take care of his son, because I'm sure he's getting hungry, so we'll go ahead and let him feed, bottle feed him, he can bounce him, go ahead and coo at him, cuddle, make a silly face, rock him, talk to him, and then we'll change his diaper. Alright, go ahead and change his diaper. And you need one more friend. So let's see who we can invite over for you to become friends with. Because you're friends with your wife and you're friends with Donnie. But we need you to be friends with someone else. So what about... What about Don? Maybe we should invite him over. Invite him to hang out at the current lot. Okay. 
So we'll get them to do that, and then we should be good. Don, yeah, that's what I was thinking. And you're good friends with your son, so that's good. Okay. Let's invite him over. He will be right over. All right, let's go outside. We're going to play chess with him because he needs fun, and this way... He'll be gaining a skill, but he can also talk with him and have fun at the same time. It'll all be good. All right, so go ahead and... Luck. Storm of all right, can we invite him to play? Ask to play chess. And let's chat with him. Go ahead and give him a heartfelt compliment. It'll be nice of you. You gotta be nice to your friends and evil to your enemies, right? Ooh. <laughs> okay. So we went with Don. Let's just get this up and then we should be good. Are you not talking with him? Because you should be talking with him. Oh, there we go. So, she was promoted to opening act. She made an, She's going to make an additional 14 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 54 simoleons per hour. She's also received the following bonus of 595 simoleons, the Rock of Ages Retro Stereo, um, and her next shift is Tuesday at 5 p.m. Um, until 10 p.m. She has Sundays and Thursdays off. Okay. Oh, pause. Go back into build mode and let's build up this house. I'm going to make it daytime because it's easier to see to build and stuff. So first off, let's take this flooring. We'll put it in the rest of the house. There we go. Alright, so we voted his favorite color was going to be blue. So we need to decorate his room in blue. So let's change the colors of these two items. We'll do blue there, and we will do blue for this. There we go. Okay, we do need to put wallpaper up, but let's grab some doors. Which, they're pretty cheap, I think. They're 90 simoleons each. We'll put this one here. We'll put that one there. Let's buy his bed. Um, kids room. We need a bed. And let's get the blue one. Okay, and that's pretty much all we can afford at this moment in time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this in the middle of the room here, and I'm going to put this in here for him. And I'm going to take one out of the bathroom and put it in here for the parents. And then we'll just have to buy new if we need more lights or not, but... They don't have any wallpapering, unfortunately. I don't think we can afford the wallpapering with 65 simoleons left to our name. Um, there we go. We gave him wallpapering. So at least he's got some. The parents don't have any, but you know what? They'll live, right? Um... I get 270 per day. Maybe sell the stereo if needed, and if not, put it like outdoors in the backyard for now. Stereo? We have a stereo? We don't have a stereo. Nope, no stereo. Oh, this stereo. Holy smokes, look at all that money. I didn't even realize she got this. Coolness. We'll just stick it here in the corner. We'll move this over a little bit. Can't. Go back. Alright, we're good. We don't... We're good on that. It's okay. Alright, so we can age him up now. He's sleeping, but we can age him up. Let's go ahead and do it. Um, more traces. Age him up. And we're going to get Dad to come in here. Because he needs to be in here for his his son's birthday. So here we go. Here he goes. Get out of the way. 
<laughs> oh my goodness, there he is. Okay, so I need to choose a trait for him and an aspiration. I'd like it to be random, but I don't know how to make it random. Oh, maybe I do. Hold on. Bye. Thanks for coming. All right, let me go. Hold on, guys. I'm gonna figure this out. I'm gonna randomize this with the legacy thing from The Sims 4, but it might take a little bit because I'm doing it on my iPod and it's a little bit slow. All right, so let's see. Go to Google. Should have pulled this up before I did this. So I was ready, but I wasn't thinking about it. All right, let's do Sims 4 Legacy Challenge. Okay. We can generate it like that. Well, this way it'll be random and um, we're not choosing. Unless you guys really want to choose his traits and stuff. But, I mean... Um... The random trait generator. Dismiss. Alright, so let's do it here. And that's what I have their traits written down for, too. So that when I do this, I can use their traits to randomize. I just like it kind of randomized. It gives it a little bit of a kick because we don't choose. Alright, so the first parent is evil. <laughs> you guys know who that is. Evil. He is, let's see... Um, what is it doing? All right, evil, active, and the last one for him is goofball. Alright, goofball. And then for mom, it's geek good. So good. Geek and geek. What's the last one? Outgoing. outgoing. Alright, now we're going to generate and see what he gets. It'll give us an aspiration and it'll give us a trait for him. So let's see. He's going to be outgoing and the artistic prodigy. So we'll do artistic prodigy and outgoing. Okay, so there we go. Hi! Alright, now we must change his looks. So let's take him to the mirror and we will change his appearance. You're very uncomfortable because you're starving to death. <gasps> Literally, oh my goodness. Alright, we need to get him fed. Um, yeah, that's the one you wanted. Okay, good. Make me a charter. <laughs> Not really sure what you mean. Oh, he's got mommy's eyes and daddy's hair. Okay, take this stinking hat off so we can actually see you. Oh, look how cute, guys. You can make him Yoda. <laughs> That's so mean. Do we want to give him a hat? 